Holy shit. You gotta be careful out here. So this is private land. Uh-huh. Uh, all the yellow pines, oh, there they are over there. All the yellow pine stuff is all private, and, uh, and we shoot out here. What's up guys? On my way to Yellow Pine Mine. Looks like I could just walk this road up there. <laughs> It'd be nice if I could drive it, but I'm a little worried about driving. Seeing how last time went. So if you didn't catch the last video, I have this land location uh, in Yellow Pine, Nevada. From 1910, there was something that my brother Bobby found in one of my mom's old books. We always wanted to come out here and find it, but that was like in the summertime, so now that it's cool out, we go find it, see what it's all about. See if I own myself a mine out here. I did a little bit of research on this place, and it started up in like the late 1800s, and 1910 was like during its heyday, so who knows where that land location came from. But it looks like they were mining gold and zinc, silver, copper, even like I think platinum at one time. So a lot going on over here. Keep losing my hat. We'll see you up there. All right, here's the road. We gotta. Cut off to you. I see a wild horse. Oh, I see a couple of them up there. Hopefully, Jay doesn't run after him. Hey, Jade! Get over here! I'm actually gonna walk around because they're not moving and Jade's not leaving them alone, so we're gonna just take a little detour and walk around them. Come on, Jade. She's a good doggy. Don't want to bother the horsies. Getting close. Looks like a little something over here. Oh, it's just probably just a test hole. Got excited there for a second. All right, we're on another road. This is probably the one that the GPS wanted me to go down. Bunch of horses over there. Then we need to go up there. And I see some tailings over there. Go so check it out.
burned that one. What do we got here? Alright, I know I probably shouldn't be going in here, but I'm gonna give it a look and I'm just gonna go in a little bit, see how far it goes. Looks like it goes pretty far back there. Stay over here, Jade. Come here. Come here. Stay behind me. Oh, shit. Be pretty cool, but. Do that by myself. I don't know, I want to go down there, but I'm kind of a wuss to go by myself. I get lost in here, or something happens, no one will ever know where I am. We'll go down to one more turn here. Holy shit. Oh, I want to go down there so bad, but I'm scared to do it by myself. I have Jade wait back here. Let's go keep exploring and around the area. There might be more of these. Maybe we'll come back. All right, well, that's a good start to the adventure. Let's go down this way a little bit more. I think we're just at the beginning, so let's go see what else this place has to offer. See if I can find my land that I own. Something eerie about this place. I don't know what it is, but I just feel some weird juju. Well, I don't know what direction they go. There's trails going all over the place. Go this way. There's a big rock pile up there. I wonder what that's all about. Go see. Whew, just another test hole. Yeah, I 
center or if I want to keep going back that way. So that's the way we came. We've been walking up this way. It looks like there's, it's hard to see on the camera, but there's a, looks like there's a, a mine shaft over here up in this area. So I think we'll walk up this road and it's pretty steep. Darn it. Well, might as well just take a break while I'm here. Do it again, doggy. Just chilling. All right, well, we took a little break and we're gonna head back down kind of where we came in from and walk around over there a little bit and then uh, go back to the van for some lunch. out of this canyon and then we'll make a right so that's the way we came down let's uh let's go up here and see what's up here looks like we got some tailings over here it's more out that way Still, still feels eerie out here. I feel like someone's watching me. Alice, Alice Mine Run. Private trail, keep off. Well, shoot. I don't know if we can go any farther, Jade. That sucks. All right, well, let's turn around. Maybe let's go back to that other, that first cave. Anybody need a lid? That's pretty cool. There's like a four-wheeler coming up the road. I'm gonna just squat down here in the shade and hide out for a second. I don't want someone giving me trouble for being up here. Um, I don't know where they went. I'm just going to keep walking. I'm going to go through this rough stuff instead of staying on the trail. You got to be careful out here. So this is private land. Uh-huh. Uh, all the yellow pines. Oh, there they are over there. All the yellow pine stuff is all private, and, uh, and we shoot out here. Okay. So yeah, so, I'm actually heading out. Yeah. So be very careful back here. But there's some really cool. Our property ends right at the bottom of that hill. Uh huh. And if you follow that trail, there's some cool mine shafts and shit over there. All right, here, cool. If you're taking pictures. Yeah. There's one. If this road comes to like a little squiggly bunch of trails down there, that's all our. Uh -huh. There's one trail that goes that way towards those telephone poles. Okay. If you follow that and then it veers left, take it left up for a little while. There's a cool grate that you can walk on. You can see down like 600 feet. Okay, cool. It's sick. Oh yeah. yeah, yeah. I'm gonna go do that. Yeah, cool. I'm camping out like down there a couple miles down the, white, the road. The white van? Yeah. Oh, right on. Yeah. Cool. I was wondering who was in there. I saw, I was, I see, I, I see your dog looking out. So actually, uh, the reason why I'm coming up here is uh, I have it at the van. I have like a land location from 1910. Yeah. Uh, for yellow pine. So I was just 
come, came out here to see what it was all about. And you guys haven't heard of California Wagon Road, have you? California Wagon Road? I'm not familiar. It must be from back in the day. Because it said it was in Yellow Pine. Well, it's probably this road right there. Okay. Is that, not this mine tail, but the mine tail up there, that had the mill house and it had, there was all kinds. It was cool. In fact, I looked up there and I saw the the sign that said that they were shooting in the private trail and stuff. So I said, oh, I'm going to turn around. Yeah. So. But anytime right. you want to come out here, if you just call the owner and say, hey, I'm, I'm looking to just do some historical, you know, photography and stuff. Yeah. He's really cool about it. Cool. All right. Yeah. Yeah. yeah absolutely. Maybe they'll know where California Wagon Road what it used to be. I, I wouldn't be surprised if that's the main road. Go out there. I might have a claim somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah. Well, that's cool. All right. You drive it. She's like, man, I'm tired of walking. I want to ride. <laughs> All right, well, thanks, guys. Have a good one, sir. You too. I'm going to go check that cave out. Yeah. Mine, yeah. Yeah, that mine's cool. And there's a across that street. So you gotta, it's kind of a little bit of a hike. If you go left, you find the, the mine tail. And then there's some great scenery that way. But then if you go come back down and follow it out to the main road that you're camped on. Yeah. And then you go across. There's an old gold mine over there, too. It's not... So that wasn't too bad. I was kind of worried there at first. He kind of like ran up on me, but it's funny that the mine that he was telling me about was the one that I already went in, but I don't want to say anything, but at least I know it's not on their property and people must go in there. So let's go back in there, check it out. Oh, I guess she wants to go. All right, guys.
those shacks. That's pretty cool though. Hey, what's that? All right, let's get out of here. Let's head back to the van. Get some lunch. a successful hike for the day. It was cool finding that mine. It's a little too windy. I couldn't get the drone up. So maybe uh, later on in the afternoon I'll walk back up the road or something and try to get some shots if the wind cools down. But thanks everybody who subscribed and liked and commented the videos. It's been a lot of fun making them for you guys. I'm gonna head back to the van now and make some lunch. Thanks again, see you on the next adventure, peace.